and around. Look, there's a... We got a guy here. Don't get stuck. Don't get stuck. Hi, guys. I'm Raging Diesel, and welcome to another hardcore episode of The Infected. Now, in our last episode, we did a few things to try to get ready to go on our excursion. Part of it was we started doing some cement and oil, and we also set up our uh, extractors so they'll only produce oil shale. And then we spent the rest of the time making recipes to take to the trader. Now, I took an extra day in between episodes, and during that extra day, I guess winter hit. I thought it, we never, I never even seen it go to fall. And now we're sitting at December and winter hit yesterday. Now we didn't, I didn't get a horde night. So I'm expecting to see one uh, at the end of this episode. And so what we're going to do is we're going to stay up till horde night and then we're going to take off. But first, I want to go ahead and let you know that we also, I uh, spent some time uh, gathering up materials and and such. Uh, I basically, if you look over here, I've basically used all our animals so I could use livers and... and and such and I was looking around for other animals to to hunt but never found any and I guess because it was late uh, fall they just didn't show up now I did see a deer at the last second but they, then it was just too late and I also been noticing one thing as well that Mike has to water our plants now because of the new update you have to put a pipe to this for it to work so we're going to have to figure out a way to run a, uh, a pipe down. But first, I want to go ahead and get started work loading up the truck. Now, like I said, I do have some uh, eggs and milk here. And I've got a whole mess of canned food. Now, I'm going to split one of these. Split one of these because I, I want to try one at, at least one. Everything else we'll take with us, if I can. Uh, let's go ahead and take our cart. That way we can load it up. I have some extra milk and eggs here. Hopefully they'll, the trader will get them. We'll take all these. And move all those there. Move all those. And we'll keep this stuff here. We got our water here. Not a problem. And we'll take all these canned goods. And that way... Oh. Now we have one canned good. One ration. And if you notice the cooked food, it went and turned spoiled on me. So I, I'm going to have to remake that. And... In, oh, here's, here's the cooked food. And it's still got a couple hours, so we possibly can sell that. That's 240, 160, and 240. We'll take those, send them off to the trader as well. And I'll have to keep this up here. And ah, uh, those onion soups, they must have went off as well. I don't see them anywhere. So, no, we we used them. That's right. We had them last episode. We took up, made some onions, so we don't have to use them. Um, 
Also, I've been constantly making cement. As I, as you can see, I've got two full boxes and I have another full box in the trailer. So. And I've been keeping the clay going. And I figure I'll do one more course because that's eight dollars I think per stack is it because it's ten and I just wanted to see something yeah 80 cents and so you go ten in. and there's like eight dollars a piece so that's a lot to go with let's go ahead and Hopefully, that'll be enough to buy out the trader. Fixing, fixing. Got a little confused there, but there we got it all done. And we'll send those out. And if I can, I'm gonna take some some of these fragments out that we can use in there. And also, I wanted to grab some glass for the windows. That should be enough. I think the windows require how many glass? Oh, five. And there's only two windows. So, let's put those back. We've got enough glass. Also, we're going to go ahead and grab this stuff from the drop box. I can't believe it hit winter and hit so quickly on us. It was only one day. I swear we had uh, one day and then since that did I took most most of that day and when winter hit I just says, well, we should get a horde night tonight. I'm I'm expecting one tonight. And we'll take all this stuff and load up the truck with it. As you can see, I've got another full cement here, and we'll put all the food in here. And we'll keep the melon. Um... Okay, we'll put the rest in here. Move all that. We'll keep the feathers. Put that in there. And this is going to go in this one, the stuff we're going to use. It's empty. Same thing with the fragments. We'll move the fragments in here. We should, in case we need them. So we've got the glass, we've got the fragments. Uh, we're going to go over here, grab as much oil as possible. Heck, we got three, and I'm going to split this in half. Plus all this. It's a...
So that's 350. And we have enough oil shale for when we get back. With all that, figure these are, those are 50 a piece. So that's, that should be two zeros. Is it $50 a stack? Is it? I'm not exactly sure. Two zeros, that would be five fifty. Fifty dollars a stack, I think. We're a little heavy for that, but we'll stick that in the cart. And one thing is is we're gonna definitely be um Looting as much as possible to try to, especially the mechanical and electrical parts. A lot of the other stuff we can definitely do without, uh, we're going to put this in here. that oil go? There it is. Had me worried for a second. And we'll stick this up in here. Now what I did is I put all the carts sanctioned around the air outer area in case I could find like a bear, a wolf, something out here to, to kill, but it probably won't see very much. Now in the winter time, the bear, the sheep, the only thing you will usually see is a, an occasional deer. And we'll add those. And I'm going to look up here, the glass, the dry bricks, we're not going to worry about. Like we only have 19 mechanical, whether or not we use them, we've got hide, eight cents a piece, not worth it. Croc skins, five dollars a piece, which would be cool, but I'm not going to waste that. Um, fat tallow, that's 280. Let's grab a couple of them. Kevlar. You know something? I don't think we're going to need any more Kevlar. Um, if you look at our armor, 83, 72, and if we go and check our boots, which we'll take with us, they're at 88. So it's, we're definitely looking okay with that. So I think we're good with the Kevlar. If we need more Kevlar, we'll probably go and loot it, or we can always make it. Sandstone's 10 a piece, 10 cents a piece. So a dollar per stack. If I wanted to, I could... Oh. I could use that sandstone. I've got four boxes. And I'll take all this down there. We'll load up the truck. And I think this is all we'll need, but I want to make some more fuel. I do have the oil. So let's move all this.
all that in here. And if I move these over, I think I can get another stack there. Uh, feathers. We'll put them away. Kevlar. There. That's everything that's going to the trader. Oh, looks like I got a little glitch there. Um, now. That's all we need for that. And I'm thinking we need to get oil. I mean, make some fuel. So let's split that in half. Take that with us, grab some coal. Should be enough. And if it's horde night tonight, well, the first thing in the morning, we're going to head out and take this stuff to the trader. And if we end the episode at the cobalt mine to start off again, that's what we'll do. Oh, we got fuel. We got a couple cans of fuel here. Well, um, there's some of that. Now that takes 10 minutes. So we'll make a couple more cans of fuel just in case, but we're gonna take these two cans, throw them in the truck. That way we'll definitely not worry about running out. And we've got our bait, so we should be all set. Got our upgrade tool. Our pickaxe. We've got two spears. Oh, we did want to make um, some more bolts. Right now we have three, so we want to make at least 20. And to make them, to make a bolt, so we're going to need to 40 fragments, 20 feathers, and 20 sticks. We're going to go ahead and harvest these all up. Easily 20 sticks. Now we need 40 fragments. Forty fragments. And we need ten more feathers. And they're made. Um, on the advanced workbench. So let's just go ahead and put it down. Craft all. There's 20. Perfect. Take these. And now we have 23. We're good with that. We put the six back. And while we're waiting, we could probably get working on those uh, solar panels. Now, we might not be able to get all of them done, but we'll try. Um, 
Oh, I don't need the coal or anything like that. I'll hold on to the coal. It looks like our, our food and water is down. So let's see how much protein we can eat. this melon. That bacon doesn't do really well with the protein. So let's go get some dried meat. It looks like we're pretty full of the dried meat. Just a little vitamins, so we'll have. That's all topped off. And we're going to make a couple more onion soups. I figure we can get away with that. Oh, we have the onion soups there, so let's, uh, Light that up. Grab these. And the onion soup in the back is done. These aren't yet, but... Oh, what am I doing? Can't do that. Gotta do it this way. Now they're in our food. So we'll have those later. They last for a while. That'll help us with our thirst. And these are ready to go again. I don't know how much cement we're going to use left over in the game. But I figure as long as we are here, we'll keep making some more. I know we're going to need to make bricks. So we'll... Dump that into the truck. got our we've got plenty of and I figure we'll take one medical kit and five small ones let's go check on the fuel and we'll just make a as much as we need but it looks like we won't need any to take with us I still got three minutes left We'll check on that in just a second, and I figure we'll go ahead and get started on... This is the last of the copper, so if it's all possible on the way back, we'll stop at the copper mine. If not, uh, we'll go as quickly as possible to that. And load up on the copper again and I'm gonna make make an extra steel in here I'll take all this copper
And it looks like I'm going to need to make some aluminum too. So make the smoothest cobalt from here. I don't know if I need that or not, but I know I need aluminum. So we'll go ahead and make some up. And we've got some extra iron here. Dump this over in here. And I think we might need iron. Speaking of that, we go check on our stones. They're doing fine. And our sand is now empty. So what we'll do is if we empty these and these look like they're full, go ahead and take it Move all the sand. Move all the sand. Oh, I should have brought a box. Still have it. Okay. Come on. Move all those fragments out. Go ahead and load them up in here. That should be almost a full box, if not more. Oh, we were going up here. Let's see how much we need to do to put these in. Okay, we got about an hour and a half it's to find out whether it's Horde Knight or not. We have to go after Horde Knight. I don't want to be caught out there in the middle of Horde Knight. So, let's see. Cobalt's in here. So we got the copper. all the copper. We've got some more cobalt. So now we're looking at aluminum and iron. Since we have the iron ingots, we'll be able to put them up. And while we're down here, we'll go ahead and check on this. There's a fuel. Just keep adding more of that while we're going. Now we have some more copper here. all that there. Put this steel away. We put this copper back. We'll grab some of this aluminum. Move all that there. And we'll put some iron down. Heck, 
just take it off. And we'll just make it all up. Because we'll probably use it anyway. While we're do waiting for that to cook, we'll go put this aluminum and the rest of the copper in. Where are we going? Oh, I got myself completely turned around. Okay, all the copper's done. Um, let's see. I guess that's all the aluminum that we have. So we don't, we still need how much here? Two. 5, 10, 17 more aluminum. So we'll make 20 more up. And we should get Horde Knight any second now. Let's uh, switch Mike over to repair stuff. that all right that should be all the iron that we need we still need 17 more aluminum so we'll just go ahead and make 20 No Horde Night tonight. Wondering what happened. Sometimes I think it's because we slept... If we sleep overnight at the mines, it delays this another because we were on the fives and now it's... Now it's going to be day 150. All right, well, got that. So while that's cooking up, and we're probably going to get cold coming out here. Put this iron in. All right. We might need more iron. Okay, we need five more iron ingots. Plus the 17 aluminum and we'll look and see what we have here how's it going? that's still another five minutes
five iron. I'm going to be over. And we can put these out. Oh, I don't have any water. Okay. Let's top these off. you out. Grab you. Get you out. This should be the last trip up there. And with all those electrical parts, the electrical lights are going to be few and far between. We're going to end up putting oil lamps, I think, up here of some sort. Uh, more aluminum here. There. All our solar's done. Our wind turbines are all done. A little bit disappointed about not getting Horde Knight tonight. That means I'm going to have to probably wait until the next episode to get out. And then we'll probably have to finish it off during the live stream. But we haven't received any electrical parts or anything. So these aluminum can go here. Coal can go back and we'll call it a night. Um, get up in the morning, bright and early. And look forward to another horde night, I guess. Um, you know what I'm thinking? It might be a good idea to try to run down to the copper mine now if we can looks like he's out, out of logs here um let's give him a place to put him Oh my gosh, there. Fill these all up. <laughs> Nether attack. This might be a good time to go to the copper mine after this attack, then. I did get one attack, um, the last episode. There they come. Looks like there's just two of them. Get up, uh, sir. I did up their damage from the live stream last time. 
I guess the re they did reset back to their default of 250, and I put them back up to 600, I think. Another steel alloy and 10 more nails. Let's go check on our fuel. Try to run as much fuel as we can, and this should be the last of the fuel that we need to make. Right, that'll cook off the rest of the fuel. We'll put the rest of the oil away in case we need to make us anything more. Empty. I guess we could set this off here in case we need it for later. Extra nails. Fragments away, and we got these extra oil. Heck, it might be a good time to go run to the co copper mine. How's this doing? 17. Heck, this just top them off. Getting down there to the bottom. I'll leave that there in case we need it. We might need to make plastic or something like that. What do you say? We think we take the uh, quad to the copper mine. Let's run. I think we should run the quad down there. I think we could fit it all. Got food. Let's uh, check on our animals before we leave. I don't want to take the truck because it's all packed up and there's no space on it. So we're going to have to take the quad if we go down there. We'll let that go. But it looks like uh, they need some food. It'd probably be okay for the day, but might as well just top them off. All spoiled food. That should be plenty. Looks like we're getting snow. I hope we don't get a blizzard right away. I'll hold on to this as a little snack. And I think we'll just... Uh, how's the... It's quad empty. Make sure it's got one can of fuel. Oh, look at all them fragments here. How did they go in here? Hmm. Wow, you know what I probably did is I thought I was going to take this down to the cobalt mine or something. I'll just stuff it right here. And I'm put this back here. This is all empty, so... Oh, let's check our fuel. We got one and a half. That should be plenty. We'll run down the copper mine, grab all the copper we can, and run back. So, I'll see you when we get down there.
Oh, we got the music. I guess it's because we're coming close to this uh, built up area. While this is frozen, it's kind of easy to drive on. You just run right straight down the river. And if we want to, we might, I don't know, we might go down there and loop a little bit. I don't know. Let me know what you think in the comments. I think we could handle one small building. Maybe we can get a couple electrical parts out of it if we've got the time. Which we're probably running a little... It's not going to last as long as I thought. Make sure you guys show up on the live stream uh, tomorrow night. Because uh, we'll be doing this excursion more than likely because of then. So we'll run over here, look for the opening. And I think it's somewhere like right here. Here we go. This is kind of like I want to want it. I wanted to move this back a little bit. I think I don't want to get it too close maybe she should put some stairs down I could do some stairs uh, placeables on uh, construction stairs Four planks. Do we have the four planks here? No, got the logs. So. Gonna need another log. Didn't even notice that the stairs weren't done. Oh. Now, let's put this back a little bit and lower it so we can climb up it. Okay, we're having trouble. Where the other logs go? There's one. Hopefully that works. Right. We'll get our cart. Let's fill up this with a loom with uh all this copper. Have to come back and get the rest. There. There. Let's get the last of it. Let's throw this in here. 
I don't know if I can pick all that up. Let's find out if we're too heavy. Yeah. And we really have no room for anything else. I was hoping to get some lead, but it looks like we won't have to. But we're full of copper. So whatever copper we'll need from now on, we should be okay with it. Maybe we'll have to take another copper run. Who knows? But we got all the copper for the next couple days. So we'll run it back. I definitely want to go after Horde Knight hits, so I'm really hoping that Horde Knight does hit uh, tonight. Uh, whether or not we get there on this episode, but if you look here on the map, like I said, we got this, these POIs to hit, and we have two new POIs that we have to hit now. This one here and this one here. These are like camps. They look like uh, there's bunches of tents. So we'll go there and I think we hit this POI before. No, this is a new one too. So we'll have to hit that one. So when we go... Um, so when we go on our uh, little excursion, we'll try to hit that one camp. But whether we go and hit the other camps until summer, spring hits or not, it'll all depend. But we'll do this. We'll do this long tur trip one, I think, as if we can. And if we need to, we'll make sure we bring uh, everything that we need to build a chair for the cobalt mine. And if we have to run out there just to save ourselves and heal through through a storm or something. We don't have that at the cobalt mine. That's so ominous, that music now that you pull up. And it's so close. I think I don't have the space to even pick anything up. So I'm gonna just gonna run out and around. Look, there's a. We got a guy here. Don't get stuck. Don't get stuck. see him anymore. He... Where'd he go? Did he despawn? Did he head back to the buildings? I've never seen him spill deck that, but I, I know suppose... What the heck? What is this? I think it's been there ever before. But. Let's uh, go ahead and eat the soup. That pretty much topped us off. Let's head on back. We might see a camped out group on the way back. So we gotta keep our eyes peeled. Have to outrun them. So. Usually they're up right here. 
Don't see any this time. Don't see any wolves. What happens if I do this? I'm over. If I split one... Put that back. Can I put one in here? If I put one of these and put these in there. There, we're under. Well, we got 21 more pieces of oil shale. But we'll definitely have to go out and get more. But it shows that it might be going a little slower than normal. Go get that cart. That way we can carry all this this copper. But first things first. Is this all? I'm gonna drop these just just to make more weight. for time. We got about five or six more minutes. We might have to hit Horde Knight first thing to next episode. Um, that. That. And we're under weight. First things first, we're going to go ahead and cook some more up. go. That took care of that. But we did have some fragments and stuff in here. Oh, I didn't get rid of all that. I thought I moved it. Guess I didn't. Full, full, half full. Right. See if I got any more space in here. That's all those. Move all that. Just in case we need them. These are all full, aren't they? Let's uh, just do this. Take these. Oh. That is a lot of plant fiber.
those in there. Move these here. This shale away. That way we'll have enough for to top everything off. Empty, empty, empty. Start to top off the copper. Put that cobalt and iron away. I think we have plenty of fuel. Fuel's done. We've got four cans. I think we'll never, we we'll won't have to worry about running out. What, how are we for time? Well, it's about as much time as we can. We might cut it a little bit short here. Did our little cobalt run. We're ready to go with this. We've got food to sell, oil to sell, cement. Oh, we still got we still got two cans of cement. Oh, we almost forgot. We still got two boxes of cement to to sell. Hopefully we can get them in the truck. And I have another one over here. We'll look, find out. See if we can squeeze it off. Worst case scenario, we can possibly stick another crate up on the top. Maybe. Or I know there's a way you can possibly hang them on the sides. Alright. Let's see. Couple. All but a couple. All full, all full. Just a couple more. That's full. Oof. There. There we go. We got these. I thought I had an animal. In the cart, but it wasn't. We've got everything ready to go to the trader, whether or not we get it. But Mike has completely filled up our logs, so we'll be able to start building our this. I wonder it takes for a pipe. Um, plumbing. Pipe relay. Furniture. Maybe it's in here. Yeah, pipe. Water pipes. Four screws, two plastic. Four screws. No plastic. 
Got to make plastic. Well, well, let's get started on that before because I'm going to have to probably run the, run the pipe underneath the foundation and bring it up to here. And if that's the case, we're going to end up definitely uh, having it stick in certain spots. So, until then, we're going to go ahead and call it. And I think we, we're getting right toward the end. I think the thing's getting, getting here. We're getting things finished. And if we have to, we'll do loot to our heart's content till we can get the rest of the electrical parts. So, if you like this video, please... Hit that thumbs up button and subscribe for future content. Don't forget to ring the bell and comment down below. You know I love your comments. They give me great feedback and they help the channel grow. So until next time, this is Raging Diesel saying, keep the shiny side up. Goodbye, everybody.